Folks, start your engines. The 58th Annual Steam Engine Show in Chilton will kick off this morning. Emily Deem is live from Calumet County Fairgrounds with more. Good morning, Emily. Yeah, good morning, guys. Yeah, we're here um, at the engine show, but we also have a very unique engine. We're about to show you one that's only going to be here this year. And right now, Mike Wall joins me. And you're an exhibitor here, but you've been coming out for like 20 years. Yep. Now tell me what you do in real life, because this is a hobby. Um, in real life, I lead a team of manufacturing engineers from Mid-States Aluminum Fond Lac, working with automation, robotics, and machine tools. And this is something completely this different. This is completely different technology, but um, opposite end of spectrum, but a lot of fun. Okay, so now this is a very old, antique steam engine. How old is it? This was built in 1899 by the Minneapolis Company in uh, West Minneapolis, Minnesota. Um, it got a complete rebuild. We actually took two engines, um, the only two surviving of this type, and built one engine out of them to make an operating model today. And it's one of a handful of return flu engines running in the nation today. Well, show us kind of how this operates, how this steam engine sure. works. Show us, like, the basics. Sure. We'll walk around the back. We, st we start by firing. Gretchen, you want to open the door? <laughs> We uh, build a fire, the fire heats the water, the water turns into steam which is collected in the boiler up in the dome. The steam goes from the end, from the boiler into the steam engine and actually turns the engine over. And, and that's what people need to realize that this isn't coming out, this is why it's so unique because it's the return fuel engine. So it's going straight forward and then coming back. Back, and the smokestack is on the back of this steam engine. And how much wood do you need to fire it up? I mean, do you need how many, like, lumbers of wood do you how need? Much, uh, we'll burn up a hay rack's worth of wood with four engines this weekend. So uh, we'll go through a lot of wood um, this weekend. And um, they also use coal to operate these pieces of equipment. And people bring the wood out for you. It's not like you go cut it down yourself. Some people come and people bring it. People bring wood in, yeah. This weekend we'll saw logs, and we'll use the slab wood from the logs we saw to burn. And then we also saw some other stuff before the show, so we're ready. Okay, you're ready. And there's so much more out here at the Calumet County Fairgrounds for the Steam Engine Show. We're going to have so much for you coming up later this hour. We'll send it back to you guys right now. That is so cool. I've never seen how one of those works. No kidding. It's cool seeing the actual fire The fire, there. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. All right, Emily, we'll see you in a little bit. Thanks, Emily.